Hello and welcome to VCCTV. I'm Joseph Rai, and this is a weekly wrap of the top venture capital deals that created a buzz in the tech startup community. According to VCC Edge, which is the data and research platform of Mosaic Digital, at least 17 venture investments were made in tech startups during the week. So here we go from the smallest to the biggest deals of the week. First up, we have urban mobility startup Rootmatic raising $2 million in funding. The capital was raised from Bosch, the Indian arm of the German auto components maker Robert Bosch. Rootmatic was set up in 2013 by Surajit Das and Sriram Kannan. The company says it aims to make safe and reliable daily commute options available for all while reducing global carbon footprint. Next, we have the fundraising by social e-commerce platform City Mall. The startup raised $3 million in its seed funding round led by Elevation Capital. The startup was founded by Angad Kikla and Neshil Vardhan last year. It seeks to create a chain of virtual stores on WhatsApp for the next 300 million internet users in India through a network of neighborhood community leaders. On the third spot, we have SaaS firm Infido raising $3.2 million. The company raised the funds from Blink Capital and Freshworks founder Girish Matrabutam, among others. The company was set up by Tanmaya Jain in 2013. It operates employee experience chatbot Amber, which helps human resources departments measure several data points. Next, we have a VC Circle exclusive on the fundraising by Base Tree Intelligence. The startup raised the funds from Axel. For more details on the story, please visit our website, vcicircle.com. The startup was launched in May 2017 by Avijit Biswas. Its product targets service management across IT, product, and business functions. And finally, we have the fundraising by electric scooter manufacturer, Aether Energy. The company raised $35 million in a Series D funding round led by Sachin Bansal. Aether Energy was founded in 2013 by Tarun Mehta and Swapnil Jain. Aether Energy will use the capital it has raised to accelerate its expansion plans and speed up deliveries of one of its new line of products. That's all we have in this edition of VCCTV. Do subscribe VCCTV for more updates on private equity and venture capital news. Thanks for watching.